welcome back to Simple Science with San Antonio's Parks and Recreation. Not only is today's experiment going to be super fun and cool, but it's also going to be very tasty. We're going to be making ice cream in a bag. So today's materials that are going to be needed are things that can easily be found around the house, such as ice, salt, two Ziploc bags, one gallon and one sandwich size, a vanilla extract, measuring cup, sugar, and milk. You can use half and half or regular milk. So the first step is you're going to take your sandwich bag and this is going to be what you put your ice cream in. So you're going to add in one cup of milk. And then you're going to need two tablespoons of sugar. and one teaspoon of your vanilla extract. Once you have everything mixed, or in the bag, make sure there's no air in it, and seal it. And then give it a quick little mix. That way the sugar dissolves into the milk. Next, you're going to take your ice, and fill up your ice bag halfway with ice. If you want, you can use a cup, but for right now, I'm just gonna use my hand. Once you have a good amount of ice, you're gonna put in three-fourths a cup of salt. That's a little bit more than three-fourths. So I'm not going to pour in all of that. Alright. Now, you're going to take your ice cream bag and place it into the ice. I'm going to put a little bit more of ice on top of the ice cream bag. And then you're going to seal it. Again, make sure there's no extra air. And now, you're going to take your bag and you're going to give it a good shake from anywhere between five to 15 minutes. Well, now that you've worked up an appetite, after about 10 minutes of shaking, and you feel that the ice cream is starting to get firm, you can go ahead and take it out. You may want to wipe it down with a damp cloth or even run it under the faucet to get the salt off of the seal. But then you can open it and grab a spoon and enjoy. Mmm, so good. You can even test out your own recipes using different kinds of extracts, crushed up cookies, or even some fresh fruit. The possibilities are endless, but I hope you had fun today. Thank you for joining us. We'll see you next time. Bye.